Good morning, everyone. I'm Christina Orangio. And I'm Steve Ammerman, making headlines this morning. People are keeping an eye on the rivers this morning. The Hudson is still rising. It could be days before it returns to its normal level after reaching record highs in Warren County yesterday. And the Space Shuttle Endeavor launches on its final mission this afternoon. Congresswoman Gabrielle Giffords plans to watch her husband's historic flight from Florida, her first trip since the January shooting. And stay tuned right here. We'll be back throughout the morning with your latest local news and weather. Good morning, I'm Steve Ammerman. And I'm Christina Orangio. In the news, flood water is still rising in still water this morning. The Hudson River there above its banks and in people's backyards. Here's Andy now with a look at your forecast. Some nice quiet weather heading our way. We're 44 degrees right now. Maybe an afternoon shower, 64, and then a good deal of sunshine for the weekend. After some morning clouds tomorrow, we'll see sun getting up to 65. And then on Sunday, we start off with sunshine clouding up late, but warming up to near 70 degrees. We'll have more local cut-ins throughout the morning. Good morning, everyone. I'm Christina Orangio. In the news this morning, we'll show you a royal wedding watch party here at the On Tap restaurant in Latham. People there are glued to the coverage and celebrating the day. We'll have more on the celebration on News 10 at noon. Let's get a check of the forecast now from Andy. All righty, Christina. While it's quiet weather over the next three days, this upcoming weekend looking pretty good. We're still dealing with some major flooding on the upper Hudson River. The good news is it's slowly coming down through the weekend. And as far as today goes, 64 the high, maybe a shower this afternoon. Back with more cut-ins throughout the morning. Good morning, everyone. I'm Christina Orangio making headlines this morning. In court, two area women accused of stealing from a fund set up for families of six children who died in a fire. The fire tore through a Fort Edward house last June. Police say the women stole thousands of dollars donated for funeral expenses. Now to Andy. All righty, Christina. Nice outside right now. Sunny skies, low 50s from Albany South, upper 40s to the north and east. And around the region today, clouding up a few sprinkles of showers around highs 60 to 65 in the valleys. We'll have more updates throughout the morning. Good morning, everyone. I'm Christina Orangio. In the news, you're looking at the floodwaters right here in Stillwater this morning, where the Hudson River is above its banks and in people's yards. Here's Andy now with a look at your forecast. All righty, Christina, right through the weekend, we're going to be looking at continued flood threat throughout the area, but a nice weekend heading our way nonetheless. Today, maybe a few afternoon showers, 64, 65 tomorrow, becoming sunny by afternoon. Some late-day clouds on Sunday near 70, then some rain on Monday. We'll have more updates throughout the